let's look at one last idea on the topic of materials. Providing graded challenges, that is, offering materials that meet the needs of children at different levels, promotes positive behavior. So the concept of graded challenges refers to materials or learning activities in the classroom that offer a wide range of difficulty for the children. So within the same learning center, you'll have materials that are fairly simple that all children can do, as well as some that are more difficult and a few that are quite challenging for children. A good example for graded challenges would be puzzles. So if you have a manipulative center, you could have puzzles that are fairly simple, just four or five pieces where the image is clear, and this would be simple enough for all children to use. But then you should also have puzzles that have eight or 10 pieces. The image is a little bit more complex. That would be a challenging puzzle for some children. And then you would have puzzles that are more challenging with 20 to 24 pieces where the boundaries are not clear, the image is more complex, and this would be something that your high achieving children could reach up to and that would challenge them. When you have ch graded challenges in your classroom curriculum, you make sure that there's always something for every child to do. So let's say in your classroom you have a child um, who has special needs, say a child with Down syndrome, or maybe a child with physical limitations, or a child with lower functioning abilities. These children could choose a material that is simple enough for them to do and yet challenging for them, as, and work alongside another peer who might choose a material that is more challenging for themselves, but they would be working side by side with each other. Before we move on, let's quickly review what we've covered about materials. When choosing materials, centers should include open-ended, self-expressive materials, materials that are relevant to family and culture, and a balance of quiet and active materials. Centers should also have enough materials and choices and materials that provide graded challenges.